so hello welcome back again everyone to my channel so i just wanna show you something which i found out so the core framework actually really cool you know like um we can actually add a, a, add a class name and its um property and value into the core framework editor straight from the console uh, i will show you here so let's say uh, I want to style the this element since yeah you, you see the layout is not really good. Um, okay, so this this is just for an, an example. So um, what I'm gonna to do is I only need to like um, copy the class name into the core framework and then just copy here and paste it into the editor the core, frame, core framework editor viola nice it, this is really cool you know like i just found out uh, maybe they have it on the doc but i rarely read the, the documentation anyway so but, but i think this feature is really cool you know it really can help us like yeah just like uh, add your css here and see how the look how uh, the, re the result and then just copy and paste it to this chef chain and nice it will um make our my my development step um faster i think okay uh, that's enough for a brick uh, for the core framework i'm gonna talk about the bricks so um like yesterday i uh, um i have i had a question for myself like uh, if I want to copy like this so I want to have this uh, element and then I want to copy it to the cover to the bricks builder can it be done uh, because uh, we can copy the element from from apa namanya? <coughs> uh, from website to another website from uh, one page to another page something like that by copy paste the element so if I copy here and let's paste it into uh, I wanna bring up my console wait and uh, my visual code okay, so this is the um, JSON structure I think I believe so as long as you have the same or, or the similar um structure you can uh convert the html code into the bricks uh json structure we, which uh, they need to uh, copy paste the element so let's go to let's bring up my uh, json formatter here let's see it better okay here so if you can see um, we have like the ID of the element and uh, it has the name of its children children ID so it indicate that this element has a two children and this is the this is the, the, the children here you see the ID is same and this is the name of the element basically it's like if you have like uh, tech, uh, basic text uh, SVG or EMG image or something else and this is the tag the take of the element itself and then this is the class name it uh, this is not the class name but I'm not sure uh, they they have like the ID for the class name because the the real class name is here something like this and this is the text of the element um, so I thought like if I can uh, make a converter from HTML to this uh, structure then I can do like uh, just copy uh, let's say I want to copy this element like like this element into my bricks just the structure itself like uh, div inside the div there is like a basic tag there is a heading or something else yeah and I tried it and that's why I love the bricks builder uh, by uh, help um, 
from the chat GPT AI so I try to create a simple plugin to just um, create a JSON file from our HTML so let's say uh, let's reload this <coughs> okay let's say I wanna have the same uh, HTML structure like this so I wanna get rid of UL first because uh, my code uh, doesn't work still doesn't work with the UL it only simple uh, heading paragraph yeah, I think it's supported I think it's already supported to convert this stack so I'm gonna copy this okay let's see yeah here copy this and just paste it to this and it will create a JSON file a JSON, JSON code so uh, what I need to do is just copy the JSON code into a builder something like that so let's I wanna put on a footer see viola now I have like div heading and heading for and uh, basic text with paragraph tag div heading and paragraph so let's see the original mm, you can see here we have div heading for and a paragraph so it's really working I think uh, let's see uh, the more uh, complicated one so it has a heading 5 paragraph more paragraph it has a div and inside the div it has a, um, a paragraph so let's copy one and then let's paste it to this convert it and as you can see here I think let's just copy and paste it into uh, like this aja lah. Oh yeah, on on this set. Okay. So we have a heading. We have a uh, basic text. Heading five. Let's see it's, uh, whether it's heading five or no. Yeah, it's heading five. Paragraph. Paragraph. Um, basic text with paragraph tag. Yes, it's paragraph. It's div. Um, div and inside the div we have like four paragraph more div let's see uh, which one inside the div we have like four one two three four paragraph and let's save it let's see it on the um, front end okay let's see element yeah the part of block example menu item yeah see there is a paragraph paragraph here yeah, I think this is um, like yeah. Uh, why I I always like uh, uh, love how how the bricks builder can like uh, we can actually can uh, have a modification uh, with our limited uh, knowledge. But of course, with help, help, uh, help, 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 tool, help, 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 tool, like chat GPT AI or just something else. Mm, yeah, yeah, this is really good. This will be like uh, speed up my really, really speed up my development pace. And yeah, just that. Just, just like that. I just want to inform you like that. So what I need, so if you wanna like uh, creating the same function, yeah, you you got the idea. You only uh, if you don't know anything about the PHP and don't anything about um, how 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 the how make how we make a plugin. Yeah, me too. I don't have knowledge about that. But as long as you can, you wanna throw up some ideas into ChatGPT AI and you 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 use the the right keyword, the right prompt. I think you you can uh, do that, and of course as usual I will maybe I will release the plugin af uh, after um, I think it's done uh, until like um, most of the basic function uh, it's finished. Yeah, maybe um, maybe next month or something. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching. So uh, t tomorrow is holiday. Yeah, it's Christmas. So yeah. Uh, uh, 
happy Christmas for all of you who celebrate it. See you on next video on the next year, yeah. See you in the next year, cause I wanna make us have some holiday. And see you tomorrow. I see you on next video. Bye bye.